AI doing? I want clean AI and they just updated a lip sync uh, function here on their AI video generator. And right now it's going to allow you to add text uh, to your lip sync. And then you could choose from a large selection of different um, audio characters. And then you can render this to do a lip sync. So I'm going to choose this video. And you see it's a girl in a sunflower field. And she's like looking at the camera, giving a slight smile. So what I'm going to do here, um, you only could do this with video. You can't do it with images. Uh, so you go down here to the bottom uh, left hand side and you're going to click lip sync. Then when you choose lip sync, this box is going to pop up and you have two options. You could do text to speech or you could do upload uh, local dubbing, like whatever dubbing you do, if it's going to be um, with your studio, with a mic, you could upload a voiceover or, or the character if you have an actress or if you're going to do it yourself. So we can just click it and then you're just going to click here and then you can just upload any audio file uh, that you have. You could do MP3s, WAV, um, AACs, they have different file formats you could do. And I think the max is 20 megabytes and that'll be like 60 seconds of dialogue. So. And if the audio is shorter than the video, the excess video will be muted. If it's longer, um, it'll, the manual cropping will be necessary. So, um, so just have that in mind when you're creating these videos. So I'm gonna go text to speech here and you could do any kind of like text here. Um, So I like doing lip sync with Kling AI and they have different uh, voices you could choose from. Again, they have different categories. You could do all here and that will show you everything. You could slide down with the slider. Or you could choose male, female, boy, girl, young man, young woman, kid, middle age. And they have old here. So that's pretty cool. And hopefully they'll, they'll add more, which would be great. So I'm just gonna go to female. And if you see here, they have like a whole bunch of different ones you could choose from. And when you click this, um, the actual voice is gonna read whatever you have here and gonna give you a, um, a sample of how it's gonna sound. And again, it's only five credits. And then you just click five credits here with lip sync, the button, and it's gonna render it for you. Uh, I have one done already. I like using Kling AI for video generation and filmmaking. That looks amazing. So you can see her face, uh, her jaw line moving with the, her skin, like um, going with her jawline, her, her whole facial expression looks amazing. Uh, and you have the background going on. I like, like using Kling AI really for good. video generation and filmmaking. And it's not like she's even off to the side. It's not like she's doing a straight on shot. So as long as you have the whole face in the shot here, it should work like pretty good. And that's pretty nice. And that's pretty much it. And if you want to redub this, you see at the bottom left hand corner, you hit redub. And again, you could just um, retype this. You can even change the different voice being like that voice and I just click it again. And then what it'll do, it'll say, okay, you want to crop this. And if you don't want to crop it, just say confirm cropping and it'll render another one for you. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Also hit that notification bell for upcoming videos and take care.